Let's talk about the dry dock incident. Monarch operatives transported you from the university to the ground zero operation at the shipyard. Still upset about that, huh? You were secured, unconscious. Well... Uh. Liam Burke went to retrieve you, and you were gone. How? Sleepwalking. Step away! Right now! You've three seconds till I pull. I better reflexes. And you're a marksman. <laughs> We know Beth Wilder assisted you in some manner. Then I'm guessing you know the rest. No, because everybody who saw what you did next is now dead. I didn't have a clue where I was or why. Never questioned it because it didn't feel real. I'm still waiting to wake up. All right. Only way forward. There's gotta be another way in there. Okay, doesn't last. Noted. When the fracture broke time, some objects became... unstable. With my new abilities, I can manipulate their timelines. Rewind them.
still no word from Burke on Jack Joyce's position. Very well. Ready a chopper for me at the dry dock. I'm heading to the island. Roger. We'll have the chopper. Seeing Paul's face on that screen, it was some kind of sick reminder. I couldn't escape what had happened, what he did. I needed to know why, but part of me wanted to put a fucking bullet in his head before he could open his mouth. Want us to send additional teams to search for Joyce? Negative. Focus efforts in our PR campaign. Amy Ferrero's confession goes live in a matter of minutes. What about Jack Joyce? Once that confession hits the air, the whole city will be looking for him. He'll have nowhere to turn. He'll come to me tonight. At the gala? You're sure? Positive. Reaper Squad doing with the video cameras up in A3. Looks like some bitch named Amy's gonna be the poster girl for Serene's PR campaign. Filming confession videos. We blew the library to create misdirection. The media's gonna latch to that, and Amy's gonna tell them the protesters were behind the whole thing. If you honestly think that's gonna be enough, we made a hell of a lot of noise out there. Well, you haven't seen Serene and Hatch work their magic. Eleven minutes after we left, I heard the cleaners had every bullet hole filled. Police have the whole campus roped off. But guess who paid off the police? Jesus. This elevator looks like the only way out of here. There's gotta be a generator around here somewhere. Okay. Looks like that elevator needs power. No power. Figures.
There we go. What the hell is that? Hello? Jack, this is Beth Wilder. Beth? I'm... You're the one my brother was looking for. I'm the one who was attempting to rescue your ass until you decided to go on a gun-blazing ship parade for that warehouse. Now listen closely. You're at the outskirts of a Monarch Cronin harvesting operation, and Paul Serene is at the dry docks nearby. Not a recipe for fun times. So how about... Dry docks. If Paul's at the dry docks, then that's where I'm... No! At. Jack, the fracture is our only priority now. Time is ending. Will said he... Will's dead. My best friend came back a goddamn monster. He knew this would happen. He prepared for it. But Paul's the key to understanding all this, and I'm gonna find... We both know that if you find Serene, you're not gonna be asking questions. Think this through. Paul was at the dry docks in the distance. I recognized the place. William had a workshop in that industrial area for years. I knew that couldn't be a coincidence. I did what you said, okay? Please, please just let me go. You did good, Amy. Broadcast just went out, but Hatch wants a follow-up confession. You got the script? Yeah, this one's more reflective. Like, wish we could undo what we done sort of deal. Dave will feed you the line. Dave? You're using your names. You're not letting me go, are you? You're never letting me go. Just give up. You know me? What's going on? I am so sorry. I didn't want to, but they made me do it. They made you do what? What is this place? They forced me to make false confessions for the news, I think. I'm so sorry, Jack. They were armed. Hey, whatever you did, it's not your fault. None of this is your fault. I'm just glad you're okay. Listen, I need to get to the dry docks. Do you know the way? Uh, no, uh, no, I don't think so. But they took me in through a security station nearby. I can help you find a way through there. I owe you. The security station is right over there. I knew Marnock had a dark side, but this? They're controlling the entire media, everything. They can't cover this up. It's too big. <laughs> they can, trust me. It's locked. Ah, okay, there must be a gate control around somewhere. Yeah, I'll check. Monarch's twisting the story for the media. Hey, it worked. It's not holding long. I don't think you're fast enough. That could be fixed. I think you need to get to this side of the gate somehow. Somehow. Oh, my God. 
You're just... You're just like them. Like who? I saw them on the way in. These geared up soldiers that blink in and out. Okay. Oh, well, something to look forward to. You know, I thought I was losing my mind when I saw that. You're part of this. I need to know what's going on. <clears throat> you really want to open that can of worms? You just defied <clears throat> physics. I'm entitled to all the worms. We're locked out. Maybe you can climb through that open window on the second floor? Yeah, that should work. Wait here. Okay, well, I'll fill you in with what I know, but when you put the pieces together, it all feels like a can piece. So everyone thinks that not all the contacts in this world are Martin Hatch, but everyone here answers to a guy named Paul Sawyer. And apparently he died in Monarch in 1999. Now, here's the thing. Paul Serene is the exact name of a guy who was heading some top secret physics project at my university. So it's gotta be the same guy, right? <laughs> Wrong. Now, I heard that Monarch was there to steal the project <laughs> from the university, but why steal something from yourself? Also, I saw that guy Paul Serene on campus once and he looked like 30 years old. So if you started Monarch in 1999, that would make him 14. So unless he's a Doogie Hauser of corporate America, that's impossible. Banana fucking pancakes. So Paul founded Monarch. <laughs> Need to get up to that open window. Is that another one of those rewind things? to get to that door. Finally. Good work. I need to make this Mr. right. Mr. chopper is inbound. I'm going to use the terminal up here and try and dig up what Monarch's really up to. Charlie, I told you to stay off the operations channel. Sure, Clarice, listen. Pat's told me to search for Ferraro, an eyewitness on the scene. Amy, tell us, what is going on here? 
There were people from our group who took things too far. Shit. Things got very violent. I'm so sorry, Jack. And they forced me to do it. I, I know. Of Jack Joyce. There's nothing you could have done. That map over there should help you figure out a route. Jack, we should take a look at the map. Ground Zero. That's the same area my brother used to have his workshop. I may have to pass through there to get to Paul. Paul? As in Paul Serene? That's why you're going to the dry docks. We have unfinished business. You may want to stay here until I'm done. Yeah. I think you're right. I'll open the door for you. Okay. Stay in contact. Find a radio. I'll be on channel three. And be careful. Yeah. You too. Still no word on Joyce's location. Yeah, I heard his brother scream like a bitch when he died. When he shows his face, I'll make him do the same. Son of a... powers were unpredictable. They kept growing by leaps and bounds. Still kicking. Monarch radio is lighting up. They heard a noise and know you're coming. Be careful out there. Thanks for the heads up.
auf. Yeah. Any idea where I go next? Well, before you said hi, Gatehouse Squad was talking about activating security measures to lock some door on the second floor. That's a start. Thanks. Jack, the husky lady on Monarch Radio seems to be unable to reach Gatehouse Squad. Remember the geared up soldiers I mentioned to do the teleporty stuff you do? Yeah. Apparently they're intending to say hi back with a grudge. So there's that. <sighs> Regarding some kind of chronon particle harvesting operation, I'm not sure what that means, but I'm looking into it. Keep you posted. Uh-oh. Jack, they're coming your way. On our way. 